guys! Hey there, how's it going? It is Fangs and welcome to another reaction video I'm gonna be doing on my channel here today. Jake Paul is gonna be fighting Anissa and Gibb. They had a press conference. There's like a 10 minute maybe recap or like version of it on Anissa and Gibb's channel. I'm hoping since it's on Anissa and Gibb's channel and not Jake Paul's channel, I won't get copyright strikes, but I imagine DAZN is gonna have something to do with it. So maybe I will, no matter what, I'm gonna be making this for you guys anyway. And if you didn't see yesterday's video, the PewDiePie Rewind one, you would know that I can't do the So Guys drop-in anymore right now because I have some complications going on with my pregnancy and me going and slamming myself on the chair is not gonna help those out. It's not crazy, but it could be. So honestly, I just have to be like sitting. I'm on like rest. I, I just can't, I cannot do that. So that will be gone for a little while until we get past this, hopefully. Um, anyway, let's just jump into this. Let's see how this goes. So YouTube, 20 million. He's kind of slowed down. I feel like that like two years ago, he got close to that 20 million. So he's slowed down. Now in Southern Not that California. I can say anything. I've been on 1.4 for a while. Jake Paul. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't understand. Sometimes I don't have great fashion sense, but <laughs> he's got a wife beater on these red like jumper pants. And I don't even know what the shoes are, but the belt, the belt is, is hey, flying. Son. Hey, son. And <laughs> did, did two people respond the to him there? Seven figure giver, the beast from the east, ladies and gentlemen. The seven figure Arabia, giver. But he represents Bath, England. He is 2-0 in his amateur boxing career. He has over 2 million YouTube subscribers. He is trained by Vidal Riley. Please welcome. By the way, he gets more views on his video with 2 million YouTube subscribers than Jake Paul got with the 20 million. I'm just saying. Man, simply known as. I'm being very like, obviously, obviously Gibb is like a friend of mine. So I'm being very biased here and I probably will have a biased opinion. But I didn't, I don't mind Logan Paul as a person really. I, I've met him in real life and I think that he's, I mean, honestly, people might say, oh, he's terrible, but he's not. Um, and of course I love JJ, but Jake Paul, I didn't really get to meet him. All I did was get to see him in his entrance at the Challenger Games and it just seemed Give. interesting. Oh, Big giver here. <laughs> the boo. room is silent. Hey, Logan, you little loser. Don't fucking boo me. <laughs> All right, Jake, let's start with you first. This is your <laughs> personal debut. You here, 10 ounce gloves, six rounds. What are your thoughts on this matchup? You know, I just want to start off by saying thank you all for coming here today. Uh, I'm excited. I'm, I'm more prepared. Where than are they? They're in Miami. Uh, you know, for me, uh, this this sport of boxing I've fallen in love with, and it's an honor to be on the on the card with uh, some legends, some world champions. Uh, and I'm excited to put on a good show. You know, we've been putting in the... Jake Paul's apparently so big as he is, but his brother could be the main card. They're not even the main card, I don't think. All right. I think they're like, it's on a Thursday, and they're like, got all these other guys ahead what? of them training our asses off in Big Bear with the with the legend right here. It's an honor to be uh, working with him. And uh, I, I look forward to, you know, knocking this uh, this big nose kid out uh, January 30th. It, so it also says the zone everywhere. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to get a copyright strike for sure. And that's what's going down. For sure. How did this fight all come together for you? This, this fight started at the Challenger Games. I called this man out. I'm not sure if he knew who I was, but now it's all falling into the plan. Now here we are, Miami. Uh, you, you, you look nervous. Are you nervous? Doing something like this is something new when it comes to fighting. I'm so sure you're, ner gonna... you're nervous. Nervous against you? No. Ali does you get look, nervous. You scared right now. Like your, your posture, everything. Oh, you feel it. You said that I believe you're the, you're the ace. You're the, you believe you're the A side of this fight. Why do you think you're the A side? Like the man's channel has fallen. And all his social media platforms, he's fallen. He's Instagram, fallen. YouTube, Twitter. He took down my video for a specific reason because I hurt his feelings. <laughs> the hairline comments obviously got to him. With the hairline. And there we go. My, my mom has more followers on Instagram than you. Did you know that? Then why are you fallen? Why? His mom. I think I did see that. He. Does, I don't know if she does now, but I did see that. No did you know that? that my go. mom has more followers on Instagram than you. Yeah, that's fine. How come you got no interactions? Where are your 20 million followers now? No way. You got your goons up there. Just know I made more money off your name than them saying yes for the rest of their lives. Oh, the boxing, Ali coming in with How the freaking heat. Are you to enter the ring against Jake Paul? The fight that I wanted, he didn't want this fight. He originally wanted Fuji Tube, so I'd force this fight upon him. Just one thing though. How short, I mean, I think it's because he's sitting back, but how short does Ali look with the freaking chair like that? 
<laughs> what so the I'm heck? training every day. I've been doing the sparring. I'm doing the running. I'm doing the training. So that's all I got to do. How come you still look like the Pillsbury Doughboy then? Uh, I don't know what that You're means. not in shape. He doesn't know where the Pillsbury Doughboy is. I'm not in shape, bro. I'm more conditioned than you. You got outworked by Deji. Round three, you lost your conditioning, out of breath. Big Bear ain't gonna save you. Have you ever fought? Big Bear ain't gonna save you. Have you ever fought three minute rounds? Yes, of course. No, I you haven't. Have your last fight was four two minute donut. rounds. Yeah, but I thought I sparred. Your last fight was Bro, four two minute rounds. Round. round three. You think you're gonna round me? three? Impossible, lad. And you know that. Okay, well, yeah, you know yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, oh, he has really good stamina. Like this, I don't know I'm about come Jake. Forward. I'm gonna apply pressure. I'm gonna I'm gonna apply pressure. Bro, you, you have the spotlights. You are a coward. It is fact. Is that, is that That's why you're going for people like Fuji Tube Soldier Boy. You, could, you got no heart. That's fact. You could you could barely beat a kid who is the same size as you. I'm bigger, faster, stronger, better looking than you now. Better looking. <laughs> bigger, faster, stronger, bro, better looking. Bro, you're getting smoked. I don't know where you get this from. You, you fought getting four smoked. two minute rounds. I fought I fought six three minute rounds. You don't know what you're getting yourself into. Tired round three. That's not fighting. You're getting I, by. Explain how I got tired when I TKO Deji. Do you not understand? Bro, you fought a guy that had no camp. He you was Deji! He had no camp. Oh, it was no Deji! You started yours yesterday. You started your camp January 6th in Vegas. American your team uploaded a video yesterday. saying, oh, welcome to the first day of camp, January 6th. Welcome to the In America! Uh, how was your first day of camp going? And that was two days ago. Did you just start your camp? When did Because I've, I've been America? training. When do you think I arrived in America? I don't fucking Recently. know. Recently. So that's why, if you're recently. Oh, you just me, arrived? That's why I just arrived. You, you used all your American Airlines miles to come get knocked the fuck out. Oh my god. Let's hear from your trainer, Hall of Famer Sugar Shane Mosley. It looks what like he's of, trying to smoke something, yeah. but he keeps, does he got like something going on with his beard? What kind of fighter get is Get it off of me or something. Oh, it's a Man, toothpick. He's, he's a beast. I mean, as far as him just starting to come to the game of boxing, man. He has I feel like you use things like toothpicks. To I'm just saying this is me being biased again. Use toothpicks and stuff like that to like move in and out of your mouth because you're nervous. I just kind of feel like that. I mean, there's a lot of guys up in there that... Look at him touching his hands, like... ...that train with them, that professionals that run with them and do different things, and they can't even keep up with him. He's, he's on a mission. He's, he's upset right now. He really wants to... I mean, th I think that it was... It's... it's uh, What? It's kind of bad that, that KSI put Gibbs in front of him, because it really, that's what... That's, he really wants to knock out KSI. He's not going to fight JJ. JJ is yeah. not going to do that. But, but Gibbs is standing in his way, so he has to... He has to JJ's not even fought Gibbs. Gibbs. How's he standing in his way for that? like to fight KSI, avenge your brother's loss. What does Gibbs represent in that path towards your ultimate goal? No. Yeah, give, give, uh, Gibbs a doormat to me. Uh, he's, he's merely something I'm wiping my shoes on, on the path to avenge my brother, you know? My brother lost. They don't look like uh, they need to wipe. They're pretty you know, white. Because of a two point deduction. It was a controversial. That's not the KSI, only reason he but lost. I got the win. And all respect to him. But uh, I'm just a different fighter. I, I have a different mentality. And after I beat Gibbs. I feel like he always tried to say pretty much, like, I'm better than my brother. I'll do better than my brother. Like, that's not very much supporting, KSI like, your brother. KSI is going to get the smoke. KSI has already said he's down. So to me, that's where this is naturally all going. I'm going to be here again in a couple of months after this fool gets knocked out. All of the familiar faces, we're going to be having the same exact conversation, but KSI is going to be sitting across, and that's what's going to happen. I don't know, but I don't think JJ is going to do it. I don't believe so. You to fight Let me know KSI. what y'all think in the comments. That sounds like his problem, not mine. My aim has been to grab that WBC belt that he's lugging around everywhere he goes, and after that fight, I want to make sure that he brings it. I don't know what you've been told. Training in Big Bear is pretty cold. What is happening right now? I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to fib. I'm going to knock out Big Nose Gibbs. Big nose Gibbs. Well, you're right in front of his big nose, but you got a big forehead. Facts. I mean, I have a big After forehead. I feel bad when I say anything about anybody because I... I at 11. <laughs> well, well, why are you talking? After party at 11. Why are you gonna, talking? Have you been to Miami? Harry in the belt. Why? Have you been to Miami? The only fight that you've done is allegedly beat ha women. Why, why are you talking? Ha have you... Have you been to Miami? <laughs> it's lit. Bugatti's boats. You're invited. Wait, do it what? Your party. At fuck party. your party. And fuck you. I'm coming for that belt. You're getting caught. And then that's you it. You don't want to come? To come to your shit party? No. You don't thank come to you. Party. Boo. No? Boo. Well, I'm not invited. even sure. I don't think Ollie drinks. You're invited. Am I invited? Can I come? I'm pretty sure he doesn't. You can most certainly be there. Thank you. So you're, you're excited about the after party. You're excited about being in Miami. You're excited about fighting KSI. It doesn't seem that you're too into fighting Gibb. 
That's where you get your head full. I'm just gonna say that's where you get your head full, and you look too forward, and you don't realize the thing right in front of you, and you get knocked up. Comes Ow. off as me overlooking him, but again, I'm I'm I know I'm training harder than him, uh, and I'm putting in I'm putting in so much effort. Again, he started his training camp uh, two two days ago. I, I've been training uh, with my brother every single day since his training camp started. Um, so you know, it seems like I'm overlooking him because that's the narrative. He's got that we Vidal, built, though. But at the end and of the day, and obviously, he had JJB I have to defeat Logan him first. So January 30th is what I'm focused on. But I know I'm gonna win. So it's just a natural progression to me fighting KSI. But if, I'm if, training my ass off. Like, if all hell like breaks he's the best loose, fighter in the world. If somehow all hell breaks loose and you do lose, what does that do to you, your career? It's your over. Future? Next it's question. It's over. In your heart, who do you think wants to win the most? In your heart. So he here's the you thing. Think you want this win more than me in this fight? I would bet my house on it. He here's the thing. You have nothing. You bet your house on it. You have nothing to lose. Is Gib gonna get the house? Lose. This is your biggest payday. This is your 15 seconds of fame. You're seven and a half seconds in. How is it? How is it so far? Is it, is, it is it good? Is it good? Is it good? You let you're enjoying the 15 seconds of fame. Just soak it in while you can. Not bad to be honest. <laughs> Especially since I'm doing better than you. But here's the thing. <laughs> I, you have nothing to lose. I have everything to lose. I'm Jake Paul, the big bad wolf. So if you, you do when you name kind of like the just kind of ad wolf these days, you right? Think you have a mental edge over me. You're fucking wrong, kid. Do I do? Wrong. I do. I do. You know boss. I this fight. You didn't want this fight. Ju judgment day. Did you is want this fight? Judgment day no. is coming. You didn't want this January fight. January thirtieth. Everything that you want to build your profile. That's what back it up. Let me build my profile. That's what he said. Judgment day is coming. You are getting smoked, knocked down repeatedly until you are stopped. Okay. All right. Okay. Judgment day is coming, buddy. Okay. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Tickets on sale now. Ticketmaster.com. It's a Thursday, it's man. I can't go to Miami on a Thursday. Subscribe now. That's I'm pretty sure the 30th is on a Thursday. In the United States it's of America. Ridiculous. Three world title fights on the card as well. Before Miami we go, would be so nice, though. Have you guys do a stare down as we get set for Jake Paul and Gibb. The stare down. He, he is bigger, but you remember I thought Logan was bigger than JJ, and that was like a difference, but really it's not. Obviously, it's not. The stare down. Why the beard, too? Yeah, you should at least, like, take off the beard so it doesn't slow you down, you know? I feel like that messed up with that stamina. <laughs> A little extra weight. Oh, he touched his nose. Oh, look at the look. That was, like, the corniest push I've ever seen. <laughs> okay, that looks really corny. That looked really corny at the end there. What the heck was that? Let me touch your nose. Oh, baby, push. <laughs> Guys, this fight's going to be interesting, to say the least. It'll be interesting. I, I have Gib. I mean, he's my boy, but I have Gib going to win it. I mean, the Pauls, they've got a losing streak minus that Jake beat Denji, which I kind of feel like I could beat Denji. <laughs> At this point, that is gonna be my reaction to this here today. I wonder what you guys think on this. Who do you think is gonna win this fight in the comments down below? Do you think that uh, Jake is gonna look like too far in the future to him fighting JJ and then he's just gonna just get swapped? Who knows? Let me know that in the comments down below. If you guys did enjoy my reaction, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. On top of that, subscribe to the channel if you're new. And until next time, see you guys later. Bye!